Today I want to talk a little bit about what robotic surgery is and discuss a little bit about what the different parts of the robot are. I think there's a lot of misconceptions when patients and physicians talk about robotic surgery. First thing I want to address is, no, the robot is not doing, doing any of the surgery. You can think of the robot as being a direct extension of me as a surgeon. And there's three main parts of the robot or the Da Vinci um, robotic system that I want to kind of talk to you guys about. So if you follow me, one of the first parts of the robotic system is the vision card here. And this is where everything gets processed from the robot. There's a camera that goes to the robot and gets put in here. And this is what kind of controls all the video. Uh, there's also speakers, there's a microphone that's attached to this system so I can hear um, what's going on with the patient and also uh, people in OR can listen to me as a surgeon. There's also different components here. This is the uh, energy um, device here that actually helps with different instruments that allow us to coagulate um, different vessels um, and use scissors to help um, achieve what we call hemostasis and uh, decreasing blood loss. This is the main part of the robot that a lot of people think about. And this is the patient, the patient card. And this actually has four arms. One of those arms over here is actually a camera. And there's three other arms that we have. So this robotic patient card is wheeled in on top of the patient. And today we have Barry, our stuffed animal as an example. And this is actually the part of the robot that does the interaction with the patient. So instead of having just two hands like a regular surgeon, this has four arms. Here we have a camera, okay? And again, I control every part of this robot. So we have a camera and we have one, two, three other arms. And we have many different instruments that can go in here. This is a needle driver. This is a Maryland grasper. So as a surgeon, I have many, many tools that I'm controlling that are hooked up to the robot here. This technology is actually amazing. And when you talk about how these arms work, it actually takes the input from what I give it and it assists me. It has like a 10 times magnification that we use as a surgeon so I can see everything much clearer. And also when surgeons operate, it can take away little tremors. So it makes my movements much more precise. And when it comes to controlling the robot, this is a robotic console that we actually use. And there's a lot of different parts to this. My hands go here, and I have two different control units here that I can use to manipulate and move the robot. With a screen here, it actually helps me set up the robot and control what I see. And there's also many different movements here that can make this more ergonomic for me to sit in, more comfortable for me. There's also pedals down here that allow me to control the camera, um, control different devices. So this is where I sit, and if you look over there, there's the robot. So if I actually go in here, I'm going to start doing some movements here. And the last thing, the last thing I want to show you guys is the actual three-dimensional view that I have looking in this console over here. So if you come over here, my head rests right here. I have speakers that are here. There are sensors that know where my head is. But if you look inside here, I get this amazing three-dimensional view of what we're actually working with. And that's what I get to see as a surgeon. And it allows me to see things that I was never able to see before laparoscopically. Now I'm actually controlling the robot. And I have an amazing three-dimensional view here. And I can do things that I think would be very hard to do with my normal vision. So I can see very, very close. And the amount of detail I can see here is actually pretty amazing. So this allows me to hurt a lot less tissue when I'm doing surgery and allows me to do a better job as a surgeon. And I think helps patients recover quicker and makes me an even better surgeon um, because this is an extension of my skills. I think it's a pretty amazing tool.